Okay, class, good morning. So for today, let's have the inclined study. Yeah? This one. So in actual field practice, most study measurements are inclined because of varying topography. But the interval is still read on the vertical rod. So the inclined measurement, which is also dependent on the observed vertical angle, is reduced to horizontal and vertical components of the inclined line of sight. Okay, so this one. So for the formula for the inclined astagia heights, you have ID, inclined distance, this one, ID, is equivalent to K times S, where your S is A minus B, since, and then you have the cosine of alpha. By the way, for the uh, uh, angle alpha that is if that is positive that is angle of elevation meaning positive and then negative is angle of depression so going down okay next you have the HD or the horizontal distance that is KS times cosine squared alpha plus C times cosine alpha and then the vertical distance you have this uh, VD Okay. vertical distance this one from the line of sight of your instrument to the distance C okay this one the formula you have KS times cosine alpha sine alpha plus sine plus C times sine alpha where your k you have this one k is the stagia interval factor c is the stagia constant a is the upper stagia here reading b is the lower stagia reading then rr you have the horizontal crosshair reading or c so this is rr from the point of your uh, measurement of your stagia rod to the center line of your uh, crosshair reading then s is the stagia intercept which is uh, a minus b and then hi is the height of instrument id is the inclined distance from the center hd is the horizontal distance and vd is the vertical distance de is the difference of uh, difference in elevation between instrument position and the rod position uh, so therefore you have your de is equal to the height of instrument this one so de is equivalent to the height of instrument plus vd minus rr okay so if you have this as hi so therefore you have this de is equivalent to hi plus vd minus rr okay, that is based on the illustration okay so let's have a problem so for problem one Sample problem one. You have there um, the upper and lower stagia hair readings on a stagia rod held at station B were observed as 3.5 and 1 and 1 uh, meter respectively. With the use of transit with an internal focusing telescope and having a stagia interval factor of 99.5 the height of the instrument above A you have the point A is 1.45 and the rod reading is taken at 2.25 RR if the vertical angle observed is negative 
23 so that is depression going down 23 degrees 34 minutes determine the following so you determine the horizontal distance the vertical distance and the inclined distance from the instrument to the station sighted you have HD ID and uh, VD okay next is the difference in elevation between A and B so you have A and B difference in elevation okay and then the elevation if the elevation of station B what is the elevation of station B if the elevation of station A is 155.54 meters above mean sea level okay let's have the bigger space for the problem so first is the horizontal distance HD so the formula you have this formula 